Hi there, this is uh, Shrikant Sari. So in this uh, lesson, uh, uh, we are going to learn about uh, how to uh, generate uh, a group of random numbers. Okay. So in the last uh, last last three lessons uh, about our study in random numbers, uh, just went uh, in such a way that we are generating a, a single random number every time. Okay. So in this lesson, uh, we will learn about how to uh, Def, uh, how to create a group of random numbers with the help of a for loop and rand function which is a, a predefined function in uh, mat.h header file okay so let me launch the ide so the idea here i am using is uh, as you know that visual studio 2013 uh, express for windows desktop okay so already i have uh, created a project under the name uh, random number 4 and which contains uh, random numbers.c okay so i am just adding all the basic stuff like uh, header files okay so hash include studio.h so hash include coneo.h okay so let me add a main function also so wide main uh, so return 0 according to the standard let us add the get ch function also okay Okay, so to do that, let's take an uh, example of, uh, sorry, let's take a variable here. So let's take n as a variable and let's use our, uh, let's take a for loop here. So, okay, so here our intention is to generate uh, random numbers, a group of random numbers. So since uh, in order to generate a group of random numbers or uh, uh, different, different uh, random numbers of, uh, of variable length, okay, so we need to have a for loop. So here I'm taking a, a for loop. Uh, using a variable i, uh, the loop runs until uh, 100 numbers here, okay, so 0 to 100. So what I am doing is, uh, I am just using uh, the variable which I have created here, n, and using the rand function here, okay. So as soon as we are using the rand function, we need to add the header file, uh, so mat.h, since it is uh, defined in the mat.h header file, so mat.h here, okay. So here we have uh, generated uh, a random number and we have just assigned it to a variable n. So what I'm doing is, uh, so I'm just accordingly using the printf statement, I'm just outputting the whatever the random number uh, simultaneously I have generated using generated using the rand function and just uh, putting it in uh, uh, which, which we are assigning it in the variable n and then we are simultaneously we are printing uh, the same uh, generated random number within the for loop here, okay. So if you run the program, until this extent, oops, we are having error here. Okay, rand function Let's turn int <laughs> I made a silly mistake here instead of uh, printf. I have used uh, some silly message here. Okay, so if you observe, <laughs> the output is very messy here. Uh, that's because. Uh, so I haven't used this uh, slash t here, okay? So if you use slash t, so here you have, okay? So we have uh, the random numbers uh, generated for us here, uh, like uh, like crazy random numbers, 100, 100 crazy random numbers have been generated for us. If you want, you can keep a space and you can see how they are, uh, how crazy they are. So we have uh, the 100, <coughs> Excuse me. So, hundred different crazy random numbers generated. Uh, so, if you, also if you observe, uh, they are not. They are uh, almost the same in each and every uh, run we are uh, making here. Okay. So, they are almost the same for each and every uh, run we are making. So, they are totally. They are uh, hundred. So, uh, since from the la from the knowledge of the last lesson, uh, in order to control uh, within a specific uh, boundary. Uh, or within a specific range, you can use this uh, syntax here, percentage 100, if you say something like this, and if you run your program, so you get uh, all the random numbers uh, generated within the range of uh, uh, 100 here, okay? So if you run the pro uh, run it once again, so you get the same uh, random numbers within the range of 100, okay? So in the same way, if you uh, want to generate 100 random numbers within the specific range of 1000, so you can again, you can use the percentile uh, 1000, and then you can control your... Uh, specific range here okay so here not just within 100 or uh, uh, within 1000 uh, uh, so never the random number generated never crosses 1000 uh, 
but it generates uh, the system the RAND function here using this uh, specific syntax of uh, controlling our specific range it generates a random number within uh, that specific uh, range here okay so in that way you can use your uh, for loop or while loop or do while loop and using your uh, mechanism to control the RAND function you can generate uh, uh, different different uh, uh, random numbers uh, different uh, set of group of random numbers uh, within a specific range okay so if you want you can control your loop uh, if you don't need uh, to have random numbers until uh, 100 or you can just say like uh, 10 so it just it it just generates random numbers 10 random numbers so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 within the range of 1000 here okay so if you want 10 random numbers within the range of uh, 100 you can uh, omit 10 here and you can make this syntax as a uh, 100 here and you can just run the program so you get just 10 random numbers within the specific range of uh, 100 here okay so if you so and so on and so forth you can play with your program so if you want to generate a thousand random numbers can use your for loop thousand uh, below uh, like let's say thousand okay so below thousand if you want thousand the system generates it's just scrolling up it takes a, a couple of seconds or a second just to generate all the thousand random numbers here okay so these are the thousand random numbers which are being generated uh, using a or random function and within our for loop here so all those fall under the category of uh, uh, so uh, controlling mechanism uh, which we have achieved through this syntax here okay okay so this is the basic stuff about uh, so how to generate uh, a group of random numbers okay so let's comment out comment it out the code until now what we have written here let's have a comment for the, the very beginning uh, for the title so group of random numbers or let's say generating group of random numbers so within uh, specific limit okay so if you want you can generate within a specific limit uh, you can control that using your uh, for loop here okay so generating a random number using rand function just writing a comment here generating the random number using the rand function okay so this is the basic stuff about uh, so how to generate a group of random numbers within uh, it's like uh, within 100 or 1 to 100 or 0 to 100 0 to 1000 and you can control the specific uh, range within which you wanted to have uh, uh, your random numbers okay so see you in the next lesson goodbye